Hey guys, Delaney Chapman with Anglers All. Today we're doing a video on how to set up indicator rigs for still water. So we walked in, hiked out from the truck and pulled up to the shelf right here. Looked like it could be holding some fish. So I'm just fishing a standard three fly indicator rig. All three flies are tied off to the eyelets with my heaviest fly sitting at the bottom of it. That way, when it's sitting underneath my indicator, I've always got tension to the indicator. Based on the spot we're fishing and the shelf I'm fishing here, I've figured the depth to be about, I'd say like nine feet deep. So I've just got a Oro sitting about nine feet above my last fly. And the depth is gonna determine which indicator I'm fishing, whether it's the non-slip, whether it be your Oro, airlock, or thingamabobber, or if I'm past that nine foot mark, the slip indicator. And all that's gonna do for me is if I've got fish cruising at, you know, 12 to 15 feet, that way when I set the hook, the indicator breaks in half buttons up to that first fly and you can get that fish to the net without having to hit the guides on the rod. So as I'm sitting there going through flies, getting my rig all set up, like we discussed earlier, heaviest fly is gonna be sitting on the bottom of the rig. Uh, for me, that's usually leeches, whether it's that balanced leather leech um, or the Hellraiser leech, those are my two favorites for that. In the middle there, I'm running scuds and coronamids, UVs, Dorsey scud and orange or the frostbite coronamid are my two favorite flies. Up top, running emergers, caddis, and midges are just a standard favorite flies are gonna be the Duracell in chartreuse, the caddis candy in lime, the GTI caddis for midges. I really do like fishing the neon nightmares in pink and the chocolate thunders. Basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a shot out there and wait for those flies to slowly just like hover down. And when I'm confident that it's tight to my indicator, I'm gonna let it sit there for about 10, 15 seconds. If I'm not hitting fish, then I'm gonna slowly start working that indicator back to me. Let it sit there for about 10, 15 more seconds. And just repeat that process until I make up my way back in. Are you going down? I don't think so. 